I think you have a tummy ache. Yeah. I'm sorry. Do I have a hair sticking up on the back of my head? Yeah. You kind of. Uh, mother spit. Do mother spittle. I don't do that. Mother spittle. Ew. Ew. I can't lick my hand like that. Ugh. Really? Ugh. That just. But by now, better? It's okay. It won't show up in the video. I can see it. Not if you go like this the whole time. Okay, so we are doing the spooky Halloween tag questions. We weren't tagged by anybody, but they were good questions anyway for our Halloween video. Porter, hang on. Why don't you move your chair over here? And also, tell them who it is, who did it. And... Oh, um, Mama Cat TV. We love her. She's one of my favorite vloggers. She's one of like your first vlogger friends. Yeah. Like we've never met her, but she seems really great and like comments on your videos and yeah. comment back and I think we'd be good friends if we Yeah, I think we would be too. But I also think that about Taylor Swift, so. <laughs> Here's my belly for those of you who haven't seen it lately. 28 weeks! Wait, is that right? Yeah, 28 mm. weeks. Okay, number one, favorite horror or Halloween horror? <laughs> or Halloween theme song? Thriller. I just spit. Everywhere. I'm gonna go with the Monster Mash. What's your favorite Halloween song? I know what it is. Harry Potter. Harry Potter? Oh, mm. that's a good one. I thought you were gonna say Ghostbusters. Oh, I like Ghostbusters. Okay. Just name something you wouldn't want to run into in a dark forest or in an abandoned building. Probably like a rapist. <laughs> I'm serious though. Or wow. like a demon ghost. I like totally believe in ghosts and I don't think I want to run into like a mean ghost because I think there could be nice ghosts. Yeah, I just like a big like scary animal or werewolf, something like that. You don't like werewolf is. Have you ever played with a Ouija board? No. We would not do that. Those things are scary. We don't do like scary very well. Yeah, we barely watched. Uh, what lies beneath? What? Oh yeah, and, like probably the scariest movie Stranger we've ever seen. Favorite horror monster or villain? I'm gonna go like the three witches from Hocus Pocus. No, they're, they're cuties. They're, they're cuties. funny, Bette Midler. What's the creepiest thing that's ever happened while you were lo alone? I don't have a good one for this, for this one. I remember my parents were out of town one time. I came downstairs and our French doors were open. And I was home all alone. And so I was super scared because once I see a door open, I could have swore like I locked it and closed it up last night. I'm thinking, oh, now there's someone like in our house. So I had to go check like every little nook and cranny of the house to like see if they're there. And I had like a bat, baseball bat with me and like opening up like the hall closet and like just saying like someone was in there. You're brave. That's good though. But it was scary. Stuff like that. I grabbed a tool. I had a bad experience when I was younger of like a nasty guy calling our house, our like landline. Mm. And so whenever men call my phone and they ask me for my name first thing, it always creeps me out. So that's like kind of legit scary. But, so yeah, if you're calling someone and a child answers, don't ask them their name. <laughs> Just say your name and, and do your first. And don't call them. Um, but yeah, don't, don't, don't call children in the first place. <laughs> yeah. Do you prefer gore or thrillers? Thrillers for sure. Gore Definitely. is kind of make me sick. Yeah. Gory. We like some thrillers. Yeah, we don't love a ton of violence. Like we don't like to watch all the violence. So. Yeah, gore and stuff like that. Definitely no, like thrillers. The thriller. are good, yeah. Do you believe in multiple dimensions or worlds? Uh, yeah. Like, show for show. Like the upside down. Maybe not the. Well, I don't know. Maybe. Probably not though. I believe in like heaven. Yep. So that counts. I believe like in a spirit world. And Middle Earth. Just kidding. And Middle Earth. Um, have you ever made a potion of any sort? Mm, no. No I've made potion. No arm. Nor have but I. But it's not totally <clears throat> out of like a terrible question because when I was little, I like loved like stuff like that, <laughs> like witchcraft and yeah. stuff. So like me and my friends would pretend. Okay. Pretend. And here's, I could see myself making a potion at some point when I was younger, but here, I did not. Here's here's your question. Read it. Number thirteen. Oh, number thirteen. Do you get scared easily? Yes. I get I, scared like, so easily. I walk into the room and say hi, and he's like, "You scared me," and now I'm mad at you. Because I wasn't. Yeah, I just wasn't planning on it, and all of a sudden she's there. I'm kind of a quiet walker too, and so. And just yesterday, I. De squeakified or like WD 40 all of our door hinges. Yes, now our door is so now you don't hear anything when a door opens. Yeah. That's what that's why it happened today. I was like folding laundry and all of a sudden she's like standing there next to me. No, I was like, ah. that's not what happened. Do I didn't even scared, hear the door open. Do you get open, scared no. easily, Porter? Nope. No. <clears throat> I get easily scared. 
Oh yeah. Unless you're a ghost. <laughs> 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 yeah, it's Lisa Kelly. Nope. Okay. Have you ever? In a bad mood. Have you ever played Bloody Mary? I think I have. I think I did that one time. I got a sleepover. And I, was I think I did it one time. Eleven. Too. My older brother was like. Go do it, do it, man, do it. And I'm like, mm, this is scary. Do you Didn't believe work. in demons and and or the devil? Yes. Yes. The devil. What? Satan. What is the devil? He's just a bad dude. Bad <laughs> a bad dude. Yeah. You're home alone, but you're here, but you hear footsteps in your house. What do you do? Zach used to go out of town a lot. I would keep a nine iron by my bed at night, so I would probably grab that. And or a knife. If I, I'd probably grab the kids, do something with them. And I would probably go confront whoever was making those footsteps. Because that's my like role. Are you gonna be scared just talking about these things, Porter? Of this family. If you got trapped in one scary movie, which would you choose? Who has the hottest good guy? Easy. <laughs> This has to be like a scary movie or like Halloween movie. Better have you know. seen? Have you seen like Ernest Scared Stupid? <laughs> <laughs> Those would be funny. I haven't seen. I don't. We're, we like honestly we don't watch a lot of scary movies. I would like. I would maybe go like an M Night Shyamalan one or something yeah. like that. Yeah. Yeah. They're like more than meets the eye, and they're like kind of cool. Mm -hmm. For sure. So of that, I would maybe say like. Science. I wouldn't. Science would be cool, maybe. Uh, if you could only wear one Halloween costume for the rest of your life, what would you be? Octopus. Octopus. You would be a witch or something. Yeah. You would if you if if I could only wear one the rest of my life, it would be like a classic Halloween costume, like Count Dracula or like yeah, or like Frankenstein or something. Yeah. Because right. Harry it's Potter's, timeless. A Harry Potter student. Hmm. That'd be a good one for you. Would you ever go to a graveyard at night? I'm not really scared of graveyards. Yeah. I would, I would do it. Even those spooky ones. That yeah. Have, like the cool headstones, I would do it. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not like super Depend scared of like graveyards either. But... Graveyards are a peaceful place. Yeah. To me, not a scary place. In a zombie apocalypse, what is your weapon of choice? I mean, probably, do guns work on zombies? I think so. Yeah, I probably want like a shotgun or something. I would go an axe. Yeah, I kind of like axes too. It'd be sweet. Yeah. You're in a horror movie. Are you the final girl, the first to die, the comic relief, skeptic, the smart one, or the killer? I'd probably be the first one to die. No way, you're the killer. You would what? totally be the killer. You're so, that's so I'm what the you, killer? I how, really think I'm the killer? You would either be the final girl or the killer. You would be the smart guy that like dies somewhere in the middle. Yeah. Or would I be the comic relief? Just kidding, I'm not that funny. <laughs> Do you have to watch something happy after watching a horror movie so you can go to sleep? If I'm alone. Like, I think one time I watched, not even that scary of a thriller, I watched, like, Legally Blonde after it because... Oh, <laughs> what was the thriller? I don't know. I thought you were saying that was the thriller. No, no, no. Like, after I watched Legally Blonde one time, I no, had no, to no. watch it. No, no, no. I watched something, I think maybe you were gone, and so I watched Legally Blonde afterwards because it was scary. It was probably, like, a TV show. I was going to say, uh, like, Criminal pretty, Minds. Like, Pretty Little Liars or something. Criminal Minds or whatever, those ones yeah. that are, like... They're like real, Twisted real crimes. Twisted and weird and stuff. Whilst 24? watching scary movies, are you the person who yells at the characters, the person with their eyes covered the whole time, or the person who falls asleep? I'm definitely um, the person who yells at the characters and the person who covers their eyes. And I'm the person Which? who covers their eyes or falls asleep. <laughs> because yeah, if you, I can't you start, fall asleep in a scary I can't start movie a movie if we started it past like nine o'clock, I probably would. I'm such a movie watcher and he falls asleep. Like if we're watching TV, he'll fall asleep. But really? last night we watched something from 10 to 11.30, so booyah. Yeah. I'm not the Hamilton, worst. Hamilton, because you're obsessed with him. <laughs> Favorite scary book. So I have I have maybe a good one for this. The Devil in the White City. It's about it's about the first North American serial killer, H.H. H. Holmes. Yeah. It's pretty interesting. I don't think I read scary books. Maybe my favorite scary book is like Twilight. Can we put an affiliate <laughs> link to that on, on like Amazon? Maybe, I don't know how to do know. that. There might How be an affiliate link below. You can click to watch it. How old were you when you saw your first horror movie? My older brothers <laughs> and dad would watch whatever yeah. at home. They wouldn't necessarily watch like super gory, like nasty movies, but they would watch What Lies Beneath or what other scary movies did they watch? <laughs> What's that one with the worms? Tremors. Tremors. That's a good one. <clears throat> That's not like horror though. That's... Yeah, but it's fun. It's like a fun scary movie. Anyway, yeah, stuff I... like that. And so I kind of I don't remember. 
I grew up watching like We probably don't even have any answers to this because we've never really watched like a horror. We haven't watched like a straight up horror movie though. Yeah. Like ever probably. The Ring maybe. I was like 14. I don't know. Um, what was your first Halloween costume? Um, I think when I was little I have a picture of me like in like a, like a Raggedy Ann outfit. Yeah. With like a cute wig and like cute stuff. My mom did really cute costumes when we were little. Yeah, there's a, I know there's a really cute one of you as Jasmine. Oh yeah, that was a good one. I was Princess Jasmine, I was Pocahontas, I was a clown, I was Raggedy Ann. Let's see if I can find some pictures for you guys. I know my mom had like a pumpkin costume and like like legit like ghost costumes that were cute for like little babies and so we kind of all did that. Yeah. Like when we were, I think those were my first ones. Oh, and like a red devil one. I have a picture of like a red devil one. That's cute. Jordan and I went as devils. Like mm -hmm. the ears oh, and the pitchforks and stuff. It's pretty cute. Thanks for watching, you guys. This is our Halloween tag, or what's this technically called? Mama Cat. The spooky Halloween tag questions. Um, hope you guys got to know us a little better. We're super fun. <laughs> Let us know if you have any other questions below. Yeah, answer some of these questions below if you guys have answers that you want to share with us. We'd love to hear them. Um, thank you, everyone who comments on my videos. Piper's starting to cry, so sorry about that. Piper's in a bad mood tonight, so we gotta go take care Finish of her. Finish your thought though about thanking everyone. Thank you everyone for commenting. I read them. I'm sorry that I don't get to answering all of them. I'm gonna try and do better at that, but please comment, tell us, us, tell us how your Halloween is going or whatever, and I'm gonna try and really respond better to comments. So thank you to all my subscribers. We just hit 6,500, so that's super awesome. I'm trying to get to 1,000 by the end of the year. 10,000. 10,000. It's a bit bigger. Um, anyway, so thanks for watching, guys. Happy Halloween! Hope you have a great night, and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye.